Hello, welcome to today's Robert's Home Biz Success Tips video. And today we're going to be talking about uh, establishing your why do it motivation. And uh, so it must be that uh, in any business, whether it's offline or online, uh, you, in order to be successful, you need to have a strong mindset that will allow you to uh, maintain your consistency of your efforts to build your business every day without deviating and, uh, and becoming weakened. So, so if you create your why do it reasons that are strong enough to outlast any possible obstacle for success that is normally associated with running any online or offline business, if, if those are strong enough, you write them down, you know, over a period of, of, of uh, you know, a few days, and then, and then on an ongoing basis, if you recognize additional uh, why do it reasons, you write those down where you can see those regularly and remind yourself until you have your mindset clear. Because as you progress through your business, building your business, there, there can enter into your your thoughts, uh, you know, discouraging thoughts or reasons why you should change course and and do something else, and and so you can you can jump around like that. Uh, that's one pattern that can that can uh, you know attack uh, your potential fullest possible potential success in the business that you're uh, developing. So so uh, just write those down and place them anywhere and, uh, uh, and review them daily and and share this important concept with, uh, you know, your downline when building a home business. Share this important concept with them and uh, make sure that they, they have it clear. Because so many people may hear different uh, thoughts about success and never implement them, never, you know, put them into practice every day. And so you want them to, to uh, actually implement this one because this one is one of the most important steps for success. In other words, if I say I want to, uh, you know, start this specific home business, and I and I start it, but I haven't created my why do it reason. Then oh look, here comes another new business, and this one it looks like they have a lot of weak, weak little little areas in their management. As I as I go on with it, so therefore I'm going to just go with this other one, and then you can go on and on because uh, actually in the home based business industry there are very relatively few companies that have, uh, you know, everything together all combined in one company. They may have a weak pay plan or management is uh, lacking harmony in their management um, and uh, uh, various other things. And so, so uh, you know, it's not a perfect world. And so you have to choose one, though, based upon the previous criteria you've set and uh, and and you know of the combined features that you want, and then choose it and just go with it, and remain committed. But write down the why do it reasons why you want to do that, as opposed to doing anything else. And 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 uh, one of the purposes of you know starting a home business and is to or starting any uh, task. Uh, is to see it through to its completion until it's, you know, successfully built and developed to the point that you want it. So clearly define those goals. And that's, that's you know, involved in goal setting. So um, in that way, uh, you know, when you're completed with that, you, you will be successful. And then the next venture that you start on, uh, you have that confidence and you'll be able to, uh, you know, uh, dive through every obstacle that comes your way. 
and they, and there's a lot of obstacles. Uh, so uh, establishing your why do you do it motivation is number one top priority, and and uh, sharing that with your downline is also. So thank you and have a great day.